Hello everybody, in this video I would like to show you what are the new features of Windows 11 build 22598. They are also releasing ISOs for these builds, they can be downloaded from the link in the description. Like the last week's build, it only includes a handful of changes and improvements but there are several fixes that will improve the overall experience on the devices. Now there are several changes and improvements also. They are now offering new builds to Windows 11 Insiders in China and Lenovo PCs starting with build 22598. They are also trying out auto launching of get started app with some Windows Insiders uh, after upgrade to help people get started with their PC. Now this is kind of inspired by all the Linux operating systems and it's good to have that. You know if someone is new to Windows then that person can understand how to get along with the new PC or computer. There is an update of Windows Spotlight. Now they are trying Windows Spotlight on desktop to be on by default for um, as the default background for new devices when you are using a uh, clean installed Windows 11 version from the ISO. They are trying this experience out with a number of limited users in Windows Insider build. So they are also trying to display a 4K desktop backgrounds in Windows Spotlight. They are trying this experience also with a limited number of Windows Insiders at first. They have updated the taskbar to show the tooltip on the volume icon to tell you when you are using special sound. Also the new media player has an improved library experience and new video playback enhancements. Now they started rolling out from today a new version to the Windows media player of Windows 11 that is version 11.2203.30.0 to Windows Insiders in the dev channel. You can now switch between the two different views on the artist page when browsing your collection. One view shows you all the albums in a grid, the other shows all the songs grouped by albums. They have also added quick actions to albums, artist videos and playlists when you hover over them for quick selection and playback. There is also a handy context menu available if you right click on the now playing screen from where you can open new files without navigating to another page. You can also access the album page and the artist page for your current song. They have added a new video enhancement feature as well which allows you to adjust the brightness and contrast of your video. In addition to these new features, they are also continuing to work on improving the performance of media player for those of um, people using a large, a very large music libraries. So you can also let them know what you think about that by suggesting in the feedback hub. Now there are also several fixes, some of them I am going to discuss in this video. Well, one is that they have fixed an issue where if you use the keyboard focus on taskbar, Hovers like previews would stay up during all taskbar interactions. This has been fixed and also they have fixed what causes what was causing the taskbar badges to come back after explorer.exe crashes even if you had turned them off in settings. Also they have made a fix for an issue where some mouse move events weren't being passed to apps for icons in the system tray. Also they have fixed the issue where hovering over some app icons in the system tray wasn't showing previews or tooltips. In the start menu they have fixed a crash when selecting the more button in the starts recommended section. They have addressed an underlying issue which could be uh, could lead to start crashing on launch when invoked with a gesture. Fixed an issue that was causing the buttons and levels in the start to be the wrong colors while using the contrast theme addressed an issue where if you swipe to scroll the contents of a folder in the pinned section of start it would unexpectedly close start also there are several more improvements that you can see from the link given in the description the entire post is there in my blog that's all for this video thank you so much for watching do like share and subscribe